Our Iron League schedule this year will be different than we've had. We've got some new opponents that have rotated on. Uh, some of our contracts were up with some of the other schools. So uh, we're facing people that we haven't faced in the last few years. The 2018 Britons, I think, are going to be much improved. We had a great spring. Coach Mel, his addition in the, the weight room has helped us have a great offseason. Well, on offense, I think we have great foundation. We have to improve in those areas, but we have some guys that have played in just about every position. It helps to have uh, guys back there with the experience, and you know, both Kyle Thomas and Sam Lanzi played last year. Doug Freeman had a great spring for us, and it was the best he's been since he's been here, so I think that's uh, you know, a good thing. And the offensive line, we're returning four out of the five guys that started. Uh, Chase Bouchard was a Second team all league guy, you know, last year and Dan Barrett came back as a the center and he's been a great leader for us in the you know in the spring. And Elijah McKinney's really changed his body from being a two hundred and fifteen pound freshman, he's about two eighty five now. So uh, we've got some good players uh, you know coming back. And then we just gotta find some other guys. I think that's been the thing that's missed we've missed the most in the last two years are uh, game changers or playmakers uh, on the outside or at wide receiver. And our defense line, Sean Cubitt Miller is going to be a senior, has had a great offseason and a big impact player for us. Mike Harvey and Ray Robinson have both played corner for a couple of years. They're back. The more you do something, the more comfortable you get and the, the better you uh, perform. We sophomores now are going to be really good players as they pr proceed. Uh, Mitch Aronson and Dave Ockema. And those guys were awesome in the spring, and I think they're going to be really good players for us as we move on. So we feel pretty good uh, you know, with some of the guys we got coming back. We hope people can see from the stands that indicate success for us or just you know, commitment to get guys playing uh, like they love what they're doing. It's not a job. It, uh, they have a passion for football and Albion College, and then that's evident by the way that they compete, uh, but also by the way that they treat their teammates. So getting back to the things that we need in terms of attitude and culture, and we kind of fell off the last couple of years in, in terms of guys forgetting the things they had to do to win, and I think we reestablished that this spring and uh, I think built some real good foundation for us to have a great year. And I think like anything else, once you get the ball rolling downhill, it kind of picks up momentum. And I think we're just getting started on some of that. And I look forward to uh, even more improvements over the next few years.